Hey everyone, here I am with my first LEGO Harry Potter Summer 2024 review, and this one's on now. On the Hogwarts Castle Potions class set that is, has just been released. So on the front of the box here we have the LEGO Harry Potter logos and Wizarding World logo. Same border that we've been seeing since 2021, and picture of everything in different positions, and all the bean pigs included, and... Then recommended ages is 8 and up. Set number 76431 has 397 pieces. <clears throat> and then on the back of the box has collectible portraits. Not the R of it. And then another position of everything then in the enclosed pick of it. And also how you can slide it into the uh, all new uh, Great Hall set that there is. In this place. And now onto the manual with kind of odd CGI rendering that there is that they do nowadays. The, the transition from plastic bags to paper bags, and then build a wrap. And on the back, how to win on the online survey, and the pieces that come with the set, of course. And then how, how it and a couple earlier Hogwarts sets can combine with the new uh, Great Hall set that there is. And then the last building steps. Oh, hang on. And also here, which are two uh, little uh, portrait tiles that there are. Well, well, these which came in my copy of this set, but yours could be different. So, and of course, almost like the ones that came in the uh, twenty twenty one through twenty three sets for that. But yeah. And so now on to the mini things. <coughs> so first off, here we have Hermione Granger, Severus Snape, and Seamus Finnegan, and all of which that are quite that came in most earlier sets, as well. All pieces same as from earlier sets, obviously. But whereas for prefer for Professor Snape, a witch does have some side art printing. I'm not sure if you can notice that. Yeah, side art printing, which is probably new to this year. So I think this variant is exclusive to this set, so great to have here. And then lastly, uh, who is, I think might be exclusive to this set is uh, Pansy Parkinson, yeah. with the kind of similar printing to the rest of which, but of course, She's in Slytherin, the other two are in Gryffindor. And then flip to the back sides of each of them. Then all the back torso printings, all the same for that. But of course, two are red, one that is green, of course. And I turn around a witch, and luckily all of which do have double side faces. But whereas uh, Hermione and Snape, so which same as that came in previous sets for that, but Seamus, which which I think might be all new to this set, but yeah, I think probably is for that. But it, of course, def, but this face print definitely useful on some custom figs if you wanted. But yeah. That is about it with the mini figs. <clears throat> and now on to the uh, classroom build to it. Which, as you see, just in its completely closed uh, state for that. So, of course, this sort of like the Hogwarts moments of uh, books sets that there were in 2021 uh, and 22, of 
course. But of course, this was a full room to that. Then, yeah. Whereas for the exterior of it, as you see, it does have a door right there. And also one of the newer style spider pieces in the uh, dark nougat kind of coloring to it. And then one side of which does have a shelf with some of the potions that there are. And also a panel piece that has a, a sticker on it representing bricks on it. And also that little uh, wedge kind of brick right here, which same one on the other side of it, are mostly for it to fit inside with the uh, big large gray hall set that there is. Since it has a couple notches to slide it in easily. But yeah. Which, if you get both of the sets, then you would know. Then on this other side, which another panel piece that has a sticker that is also bricks but with a couple uh, cobwebs on it, and also this hollow space for the this potion, of course, or test tube potion. Yeah. And then this upper space, which that has a couple of uh, pinhole bricks on there, mostly to connect also to the big Hogwarts. It's a great hall set as well, and there's also plenty of open space for this little set, a seat right here that you can sit a fig on to and sit at this desk with a, a quill and a little scroll uh, for uh, spells and such. And now how to open this, it's almost like the Hogwarts Moments book sets and banner sets, of course, well, can like Turn this right up, and then turn the, pull this wall out, and then this out as well. And got a large open area to it, although kind of similar to the, but kind of feels like some of the like, uh, like 2001, 2002 kind of range of sets where they were kind of open spaced for that, but. Luckily, this is sort of a newer version of that, since it's a newer age of Lego. Now, let me focus. Well, I guess he does have that uh, panel piece there. Yeah, or a large panel piece, but a sticker on it that has a bookshelf, or a little shelf with various potions and things. And above of which is that tile piece there, and also a little bench kind of part to it, and and also as you'll see, and also these little uh, corner uh, tiles that all have stickers on them, which get about six times in this set. So of course they're so off. So there's quite a bit of stickers in this set. So be aware of that. And then. As for this little section, which is a little table that holds a few uh, contained jars that have a few different ingredients in them, ranging from like diamonds, which are just flat studs that, that are trans blue with sparkly in them, like some earlier sets kind of did, and then leaves, and then also red spikes and uh, white flowers, of course, and then down below, which are uh, cylinders in translucent colorings obviously represent more potions and jars. And then one section, and also this section that does have a, a crystal heart piece on there, and also a little uh, a lantern kind of build to it, but made with a lightsaber hilt, kind of interesting. And also a, a little goblet or goblet kind of piece in gold. And this other section, which is these like bubblish kind of pieces that are in the little pot cauldrons, and also one large cauldron that has a large build to it, of course. And then also do have a couple of the same scroll pieces, and also feather quilt pieces as well, and also a spoon fork pieces. And that. But also these desk kind of areas you can also pop off since it's on a tile and a jumper, or a course. And then also a, another one of those test tube pieces, but with a trans orange coloring compared to the other that had trans yellow, of course. And then right on the back side is the same exact as the other uh, panel piece, but with this uh, chalkboard look to it, showing the 
uh, equations and such that there are. And also this uh, little uh, clip with a bar piece on it. Not sure what for, although it kind of makes it look almost like one of the very early sets where it used where they used bar pieces as wands, of course. And then on to folding it up. Here you have here. We're going to take this table section and fold it inwards and then close it around that and then this wall close around it like so. And then you're good to go. Good for both extra storage and also for putting into the uh, great halt set, obviously. Let me get everything here. So overall, I think this is which a quite kind of good set for how it is. I do get plenty of unique colors of pieces, like the test tubes and the uh, bubbling, uh, small bubbling potion parts, and of course the different test tubes and such, and also the sparkly flat studs, of course, and. Whereas the minifigs, which may have been kind of used before, but at least we finally get a, a new ex exclusive one of Pansy Parkinson, and also an exclusive variant of Snape, which nice to see here. And and of course this is what, and whereas if you like don't care to have the big great hall set to fit this into, this also still works out as a nice display piece as is. But yeah. And also, uh, and also, as for the uh, thirty to forty dollars that it is, uh, which kind of steep for how it is, like whereas kind of small for the forty dollars or whatever. Well, it was almost like some, how most current uh, Star Wars sets also kind of are, where they're sort of similar sized at the same price point. But, but you know, as for the near four hundred pieces for that. It was still kind of workable for you. Yeah. But also, do you get plenty of unique te building techniques in this set, obviously? And I guess that is about it there. And also, so the arrangement here kind of a good callback to some of the early 2001 2002 uh, uh, kind of sets that there are, where some of them kind of had swing open kind of features. But yeah. And also able to just plop into it, but also the same with the uh, 2021 through 23 uh, Hogwarts arrangements kind of did, but yeah. And now, if any of you are looking to get this set to put inside the big, large, great hall set, then definitely pick it up. And if you are looking for a decent enough set to be, or I mean, and if you're looking to have to have this in your uh, Harry Potter set collection, also definitely pick it up. And that is it for this video. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.